Hey everybody! I am pretty tired tonight, so I'm recording this in my bed. I have my pillow right here. I'm totally ready for bed. Unfortunately, I have to get up and turn the light off. But uh, um, I just want to start out by saying thank you so much to everybody who has uh, either made comments, um, given me support and encouragement. Um, I'm just really blessed to have so many positive people in my life and even people who don't know me who are being positive. So um, I, part of me was afraid to uh, share this with anybody because I'm just really sensitive and I know that people can say mean things. So um, I just uh, thank you so much for being positive and this is a really special time in my life and it's a choice that I made for my own body. So um, anyway, uh, basically, I, today's di today is day five, and I have drank three quarts of water today, about, um, I weighed 158.6, so that's, uh, minus 2.6, or excuse me, 2.2 pounds. I'm really tired, so excuse me if I'm stuttering around a little bit. Um, and that's a 13.4 weight loss. Uh, that seems like a lot, but I think... You know, you lose more in the beginning and then you start to taper off and lose more like one pound a day or, you know, maybe one day you won't lose anything or something. Um, <coughs> um, I was really, I was, I had a great day today. Uh, I did a lot. I did too much and I didn't lay on the couch or rest or sit on the couch at all, pretty much the whole entire day. And that was definitely a mistake. Um, so I learned my lesson. I'm fine. I'm just tired. You know, I'm just more fatigued. My, my body just crashed like it was, I laid down and then when I went to get up, it was like, whoa, you need to stay laying down. <laughs> um, so I just need to go to bed earlier. I need to go to bed when the kids go to bed. I need to, you know, get this done as soon as I can and do my video blog as soon as I can and um, get to bed earlier. And um, I'll try to maybe take more naps. I'm just not very much of a nap person. I'm such an on um, mommy that it's just hard to do that. So I'm only taking one 15 minute nap. That was on the first day. Um, I'm still coughing up like crazy. I'm not swallowing my mucus. I'm getting rid of it because I believe that this is a, an expelling process. So, um, I'm happy about that. Uh, I'm, I have random muscle pain. I had some random muscle pains today. My calf, um, like a little muscle in my calf was sore, you know, probably just something I did and I didn't even realize it, you know, uh, because after lifting, I lift some jugs yesterday, some 60 pound jugs and my uh, muscles underneath my, like, you know, some of my back muscles were sore and I'm sure that's what that was from. I had a big day yesterday too. Uh, and then I, um, my neck was sore from working on the computer, had to get some work done on the computer today and I just like had to lay my head down for a second. Um, I, my back was hurting a little bit, so I just used my awesome massage chair that I so appreciate during this, um, experience. Uh, I, uh, this is, you know, I'm not, um, editing details out of this fast, so I farted today. That was kind of different, uh, because I haven't, like, had any action at all besides that one enema that I did on the second day that gave me a lot of relief. Um, and that's normal. I burped a little bit today, too. Um, I am totally at this point, very motivated. I'm sure you might want to know what, you know, what keeps me going. And I'm just really motivated, uh, by curiosity. I have a lot of questions, you know, what's to come? Who knows? I don't know. Um, I know that, that this experience can bring really amazing results toward the end. And, um, you know, I'm just kind of curious to see what will happen. How will I feel? at the end of this, you know, uh, I'm really in tune with everything. I'm really sensitive to everything and kind of analyzing things and smells are so strong. Everything is just stronger right now. It's amazing how much energy is taken up by the digestive process and just thinking about food, making food, um, and just the obsession with it. It's insane. I mean, we do have to have it, but you know, I think we go overboard for sure. Um, you know, and the que another question is, how will my diet change? I, I had become a, pretty much a vegetarian. I mean, you know, with a couple of exceptions, but more vegetarian the past four months. So 
will I go straight up vegetarian after this? I don't know. These are all questions to come. Um, and another question is, uh, what will I break my fast with on video? You know, what will, what will it be? I don't know. I don't even know yet. So, um, and of course I'm going to share that experience with you guys. So, uh, this has been a super awesome experience so far and I've had, um, some really neat moments, uh, spiritual moments as well. And I know that there's going to be more of those to come, um, I, um, have been more emotional and, um, basically I just want to say that I couldn't do this without God. I really believe that he led me to this point and anybody that knows me knows that I'm super into health, uh, and it's probably not a surprise that I would do something like this, but, um, but, uh, I definitely feel like God has planned, he planned the whole thing. He planned you know, the timing and everything. He gave me this time to be able to do it. And he's giving me the strength on a daily basis. So I thank you so much for all of your prayers. I've got a lot of friends praying for me. And um, and I'm just really excited that I get to share this with you. So I am probably going to say goodbye right now because I'm ready for bed. But uh, I can't wait for tomorrow, day six. I can't believe day six is already almost here. So the time is kind of, in a way, going very slow, but in a way, kind of going kind of fast. So um, I got this quote from my friend, Julie, which I haven't talked to in a little while, but, um, and she would never remember that this was something that she said, but uh, my my business is Breathe Tree. And, uh, and like Julie said one day, just breathe. Just breathe, folks.